Okay, today we're going to show you how easy it is to start up a GT24, assuming that everything was prepped from the night before. So we're ready to go. First thing we're going to do is put the plugs back in. And then we're going to turn the fill switch on. And we're going to wait for it to fill. The tank is made up of two compartments. The wash side uses hot water, the rinse side uses cold water. When the fill switch is on, it's trying to maintain the wash side temperature at 150 degrees Fahrenheit. When the conveyor switch is on, it spins the conveyor and turns on the spray pumps. A cycle takes approximately two minutes. To use the glass stop arm, put it in the middle position. When the glasses hit the arm, it will shut off the conveyor and the spray pumps. The glass stop arm is meant to prevent from washing the same glasses repeatedly. However, if you want the cycle to continuously run during busy times, move the glass stop arm to the side. The red chemical light flashes when the chemicals are low. A cracked or damaged pickup tube can also cause this to flash. At the end of the shift, shut off the fill switch and the conveyor switch. Pick up and remove the front shield. Lift up and remove the top cover. Slide the conveyor up and remove. Remove the drain plugs. The water on the wash side will be hot. Unlatch and remove the spray boxes. Move the rinse tank guide, drain screens, check spray boxes for seeds or debris, and wipe out the components and the walls inside. Let them air dry or wipe with towels, then replace all the parts.